welcome back. We're back in Timberborn today with our ever-expanding colony. And the devs have made another pass and once again changed the towers back to three science. And I wanted to give them the benefit of the doubt, but the more, the more I see how they're using golems, the more I think they just hate their own creations. They, they don't like golems, so... They're trying to make them easy to use, but very inconvenient. So we'll see how this all pans out at the end. I hope they have a master plan, but I guess we'll find out. Today, though, we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, we are first going to remove all of this, because that's actually the height that I would like it to be. That can go away. However... I would like, let's say, oh, there's my landscaping. Let's say we're just going to put you on the edge here. I would like all of this to get done so that we can get rid of those trees. We're going to fill in this. And then here, we're going to do a little more filling in. All the way to the edge. Here we go. Ta-da. And we will fill this all up here. And that can all be facing that way. That's fine for now. Uh, we will change this to this way. Now let's just go this way with it. There we go. There we go. All of that can go in. And then here, we're going to make that across this here. And we're going to put in a road. And what this is going to do for us, hopefully, if I get it the right height here, is give us a little area where we can have a water farm. But in order to have a water farm, we're going to have to, let's see, one, two, I think. I think that's the right height. Let's find out. We're going to have to put in a couple of things. Let's start with the triple floodgate. Nope. We are going to have to do that. We are going to have to do this. There we go. All right. And now we need... Actually need to dig this back out. And once they do that, we will take a look and see what else we've got in there. But for now, let's go to the... We're going to put in the farmhouse here. There we go. And... Hmm. We are going to need some storage here, aren't we? I guess we could do a large storage... Uh, do I want the large storage here? Large storage, large storage, and then maybe... See, if I did one there, no, that would only leave one. Let's see. How many would that leave between? Uh, let's find out real quick. There we go. We'll put in a storage here. There we go. Um, and that can be for all the stuff that needs held. Now the question is, how do I get up there? Um, hmm, <laughs> Let's take a quick look and build in here. Uh, that won't work. That won't work. Nope. Um, you know what? Let's get rid of these. And we'll try a different approach. Let's go with smaller warehouses. One here. Uh, and then I would like... Well... We will have to get rid of all of this, I think. But we can, in the meantime... 
put up this, and then I have a plan. So let's go ahead and turn that up to the highest speed. Do this, that, and they claim there was some performance uh, upgrades, but I don't see too much of that effect. I know I've got quite a few people in here, golems and beavers, but I, I'm still not really seeing it, so... I'm not sure where they improved the performance, but they said they did at least, so that's good. At least they're thinking of performance. Alright, so we've got more things here. Now, over here, we're gonna need some more land to build on. I believe we're gonna be shy on power. So once again, we're going to go to the large plates here. Let's see. Does that fit right on there? Yep, it sure does. Put them over here, too. There we go. Just to give us a little more water, but uh, not missing out on any space, really. There you go. That looks nice. Maybe we should go ahead and plan for a bridge across here. Let's see. We'll go... How about a bridge right here? Is that too tall? Nope, that's just perfect. And we'll do the six from here. Do I need... There and there. There we go. Let's do six... Well, actually, do that. Toss a one in here. And we'll do a six the other way. There we go. And we'll split the districts by doing that. There we go. More bridges to put up. Wonderful. Let's check on our trees over here. We've got a couple of places still to plant. That's fine. That Hopefully helps us get caught up on those trees. How is our area over here going? They're not getting much in there. There's nobody in here, so let's put some stairs right there. We'll go to the maximum importance, and hopefully they can cut all of these trees. Then we can level that out to add more trees back in. Speaking of which, though, let's... Toss some dynamite here, too. Let's see. All of this can go ahead and be dynamited. That can. This and this. And that. We'll figure out how to get up there eventually, I'm sure. I really wish there was a repeat option so we could just have them constantly put dynamite on there until... Until it goes away. There we go. Uh, oh, with them changing up the, the science, we are going to have to turn a couple of these back on. We'll see how that regulates back out. I don't want to lose too much production, but then again, I don't want to lose all my science points and all my golems go down either. It looks like we're going to need a couple more on. So let's turn this back on. Let's turn a couple of these back on. In fact, let's just turn them all on for now. And we will work with what we get. So, oh, good. Looks like... There we go. We even have a little water stored up. Can we make that a high priority? There we go. Now here, we're going to do two... And then maybe one here. They really only need one to get down into this area. Let's mark stuff to be planted here. We're going to do cattail on the smaller side. And we'll do spatter dock on the bigger side here. Oh look, they got the trees out of there. So let's see. Can I get rid of that and that? And we will go landscaping. This can all go in. Just like that. There we go. 
we'll tell them to uh, prioritize a little bit of this right here so that we can go ahead and get more of our wheat put in. Where's our wheat? There's our wheat. Speaking of priority, I would like... I would actually like this one to be normal and this one be higher the rest of these can be normal there we go that will get them set up so that they can get going they're also still set for regular beavers so let's set these back to golems set for golems there we go uh, our, our metal plants that we have I don't know why you're regular beavers. Let's get you out of there. One, so you don't get hurt, and two, so that they can work all night. There we go. How is the rest of these? Looks like we have almost enough golems. We have four hanging out somewhere. Is it in this district? It looks like it's in this district. Change you. Change you. There we go. Not sure why there's one missing here. Oh, okay. That's why there was one missing. I just didn't tell him to go in there. All right, over here, let's add a new route to this. We'll add some dirt. Uh, what's our distribution limits on this? Let's go 25. Okay, there we go. They can keep gra gathering some out of there. We need treated planks. I'm going to move that up to the highest so we can get a little bit more focus on it going forward. Let's see. Looks good so far. I guess we really don't need this log wall anymore. We'll just take out this levee here. There we go. Yep. Makes a little dent in the water table, but that's okay. We've got plenty of water going around. Looks like they're ready for us to plant all this wheat. Oops, not cactus. Hmm. Wheat. There we go. They will get that planted. Who is gathering over here? Is anybody gathering? Kind of doesn't look like it, does it? No, I don't think I put a gatherer in. All right, well, we will put a gatherer in. Gathering flag. Let's put one about... Mm, about right there. That looks good. I could take out one of the bushes, but... You know what? I would prefer to do that. Let's do that. Uh, get rid of this. Here we go. Out you go. Get that taken care of first. We'll add... We'll see if they can get that in there. And it would be nice if they could get at least this part in there. There we go. We got two little spots in there that are dry, but that's okay. Eventually, we're going to make some canals here. In fact, why don't we start working on a canal here and there? We should have plenty of dynamite just hanging out. Well, they've got all the trees cleared out, so let's detonate these down. Luckily, we can toss dynamite down from the top here. Or I guess they can just put dynamite in. Detonate that. There we go. More there. Get all of this. In this area that we've already freed up here, let's go ahead and just fill with more maples. It's all the maples right now. Oh, well, here's a place I thought I decorated, but I guess I did not. So let's put a couple of benches in here. Maybe a shrub, shrub, and a statue. There we go. That'll work pretty well. How about another shrub, another shrub, and then we'll do some well-being here. Maybe 
Let's see. Shrine. Yep. And do we want anything else that just takes one? Uh, let's just do... Actually, let's make the shrine face the other way so that we can just do this. Shrine. Shrine. There you go. Two shrines. Looks good. Well, we've got a couple more places over here that we can put stuff. Let's go... Uh, do, do, do. What do we want to put in here? Some more decoration. I suppose we could probably do a fence. Because we don't want beavers getting into these gears. There we go. That'll work just fine. Another one off of there, too. There we go. Now the question is, you sit up here, you have plenty of room. How are we going to get to the bottom here? I guess we can do something similar to this, where we come by and try and get those in there. Let's, we'll, we'll come back to that once that is all cleared out. Hey, looky here, we've got our our maple area ready to go. Did we put this back to scrap metal? Yes, we did. Good, good. All right, this is looking pretty good here. Not too bad. They are not getting any planks. Do we have planks being made? Or are we just low on logs? We are low on logs, so let's pri prioritize these guys. Or where to plant some more trees. There we go. First step in the canal. Here's another one. And let's get... Looks like our gatherer is ready to go here. There you go. They can get all those in and we'll worry about them in a bit. Let's see. Okay. What are you guys doing down here? Are you guys building from the bottom? Yeah, but you should be building over here, and you're not. I'm not 100% sure why. So, we're gonna do this. Delete. Get rid of all of these. There we go. We are going to build in some landscaping. That goes out to here. There we go. We are going to remove that and this. Put the staircase at the end here. There we go. And we'll attach this back here. Let's make these all high priority too. And now with that, we can plan out some more construction here. I'm going to do this. And then we will do second set of steps, another storage here, and then around the front here, we'll do this, set this for the grilled version of spatter dock, whereas I believe this I forgot to set, so we'll empty that out here real quick. But this should be for just spatter dock. There we go. All right. We've already got those in there. That's pretty good. Well, I'll accept one. They'll get that another day. Let's do a path around the front here. And another set of steps here. And a grill right there, right on the edge. Okay. And just for decoration purposes, you know what? Let's put... Let's put a bench here so that they can sit here and eat their grilled spatter dog. That sounds good. Oh, I even need a path here, don't I? Then we can try and find something to put here that might look nice. Uh, we could do a monument over here, I suppose. 
Let's see. Yeah, I like that. But we're going to set it to the very lowest so that it doesn't get built in front of other things. Get rid of that. There we go. Not too bad. They're still working on getting all this filled out. Well, let's go ahead and get trees in here for now. And more trees, because they can just walk right through trees. Do that, and that. This here. And some more here. Go over. And out. Out. There we go. They'll get to putting those trees down eventually. So it looks like we've got some more dynamite in over here. In fact, quite a bit of it. There we go. That's an excellent explosion chain. Let's go ahead and get our maples in. There we go. Another one to explode there. We will put up a platform right here. Yep, that'll let them get to it. Well, they've got the outer wall built up here, so... Let's go ahead and take a look and see what it is that we need to get water in here. Now, I could probably use a water dump and it would be just fine, but I think we're going to go a little bit better than that so that we can use it to fill up all the canals in this area, like that one that I just made. So let's put in the path here. Um, You know what? I'm going to do twos. And then ones, just in case we ever want to transfer power. Power from where? Power from over here. Let's see. So we're going to need a deep mechanical pump. There we go. So those probably aren't going to be needed at the end of the day, but that's okay. Now, how do we get this power? Let's take... And go there and there. Get rid of the path. And we will do that. Power. We will do the four way first, so they put that in first, hopefully. Spin that around. And that gives us another one to uh to get power it should fill up this whole area along with filter down into here and eventually into this canal here in fact we might as well just kind of start it now just get that out of the way oh uh, let's see might slow down our building in that area for just a bit but that's not terrible. Oh, let's put a, a cog head on you. There we go. And I was going to... Let's demo that tree right there. Actually, no, don't demo that. It's at 99%. So it ought to be done here just any time. And we can cut it down. And then put another uh, lumberjack over here. There we go. Somebody will come get that. It's set to not replant. Oh, they finally got that tree out of there. So let's put that up there just like that. There we go. That'll help get some of those trees out of there. This area now it has all the six trees. So I think we could definitely use a couple more lumberjacks. We do have some trees growing that aren't getting quite cut down yet. Let's detonate all of those. And we might not be able to detonate them all the way back right away, but that's okay. We'll set those to the highest priority, too. There we go. Uh, I would like those slightly higher priority. Maybe not the highest, but slightly higher. Well, it looks like we're a little bit low on areas for energy. So let's see if we can get some of those in there. 
and get this sorted out before it becomes too huge of a problem. Let's assign priorities. All of those. All of those. And we'll see how long it takes to get those set up because we have an issue with all of our golems being out of power. When they're out of power, they consider themselves unemployed. So, we need to get those in there. We need to... Although, there are some open areas, so I'm not 100% sure why they're not going to get charged. That seems a little odd. There are four open areas right there, everybody. So... Why are you not getting charged? I can't say that I understand. Well, they will hopefully figure that all out. They have power. Um, well, maybe. Anything else I can turn off. Don't quite need you. That will give me... Close. We will turn off, I guess, one of the gear places. Two of the gear places. There we go. Alright, let's get everybody charged back up. Hopefully that goes back down. We got no recipe selected. We want drilled spatter dock. That can be a cog head. Yo, we have one injured beaver. That's odd. We don't usually get injured beavers. Where is he working at? He's unemployed. I really wish it tells me where he's previously employed. Uh, construction materials. I think we'll be all right. Hopefully, this goes back down here. Well, while the golems are having a hard time, I think we are going to resort to the old way of doing things. Let's toss in a water tank here and here. There we go. Those are connected in, and we will put in a couple more, oops, water, deep water pump. There we go. And then the last step, we will squeeze in a house here or two. Large row house. There we go. And there we go. Alright. So that will increase our population here of actual beavers. We've got one pod that seems to be constantly kicking out some energy. Or kicking out some beavers. But we are a little behind on that. That will give us a total of 15, I think, or approximately. And we have housing for... Uh, let's see. Homeless beaver. Well, 8. So 8, 16, 24 beavers. Well, first things first, let's check the population here. Uh, District 9, let's go 24. And we'll go with that for now. We're going to try turning everything back on and see if it goes back to being a problem here. Now that we have more charging stations, maybe they just didn't have enough or they didn't want to go to them. I'm not 100% sure there. Let's go ahead and put in another breeding pod, though, right there. There we go. 
Guess we don't really need these stairs here anymore, so let's just get those out of the way. There we go. Well, let's go ahead and make a major canal here while we wait for other things. Part of the land will go up, part of the land will go down. There we go. Landscaping. Oh, some dynamite in here. And I don't think they have a ton of stuff to build, so... You never know. Hopefully they'll handle that just fine. Well, since they got our first metal platform in over here, let's go ahead and plan for the next set of power stations. Here we go. One. Two. And we are just going to... This... And that, and all of those. Put that on pause until the rest of this is built. Hey, look at this. They've got quite a bit done here. So let's go ahead and get rid of all of this here. There we go. One more space open. We've got another couple of long columns to take out, but that's okay. Maple, there we go ahead and plant some more wheat. Wheat. There we go. What was there? Yep. There we go. And let's just make a path around here. Not that it really does anything, but hey, you never know. We'll go ahead and do that. I don't know if we can even build either of those, but we're about to find out. Well, our big water lake is dried up, but we've only got 0.3 days left, so I think we'll be okay. We'll make it to the end of this one. All right. Well, there's another part of the canal done. We are right in the middle of the next wet season. So everything is starting to fill back up. We'll see how full all of this gets. In fact, it looks like I could probably lower this all the way down. Let in some water. Won't be a ton of water, but it'll be enough water. Hopefully. To at least keep this area a little wetter for a little while. Looks like I also need some right there. There we go. And I can put down more places for spatter dock. Yep. After a last minute realization and move, it looks like we're up and ready to go on the water farm. It's starting to fill, so that'll take just a bit. But I think we're going to end it here when it's filling up, and we'll take a look at it next time. Next time, I think we're going to take a look more into evening out populations again. Uh, the golems have been just smacked with a nerf bat so many times. It's uh, it's getting ridiculous. So we might have to look into old-fashioned beaver power and just see if we can get their population back up. But uh, I think for now, that is where we're going to leave it. So just want to say uh, thank you for all the likes and subscribes and even uh, all the clicks on all my previous videos, they're doing pretty well, much better than I ever thought they would. So just thanks again. And uh, just wanted to say thank you very much for stopping by. And I hope to see you next time. Bye. Whoa.